Hey everyone, welcome back to Footy Leagues Around the World. It is your host, Ryan. Today's subject is unique because it is a British overseas territory that is located in the Atlantic, but is not a Caribbean country. It is Bermuda. Footy Leagues Around the World. Footy Leagues, heck yeah. Bermuda is made up of a group of islands in sort of a claw shape located about 665 miles east of Cape Hatteras in North Carolina in the United States. Though the territory's most popular sport is probably cricket, the people of Bermuda also have plenty of time for soccer too. There are two semi-professional leagues in the country, the Bermuda Premier League, also known as the Digicel Premier League for sponsorship reasons, and the first division below that. There are also two amateur leagues, the Expansion Division and the Masters Division, though I don't have much info on either of those leagues. The top two leagues have 10 teams each. The winner of the Premier League qualifies for a spot in the Caribbean Football Union's Club Championship, which acts as a qualifying tournament for the more prestigious CONCACAF Champions League. However, no club from Bermuda has ever made it to the Champions League. The bottom two teams from the Premier League are relegated to the First Division, while the top two teams from the First Division are promoted. There is no relegation from the First Division. Though no official women's league exists, the Bermuda Football Association's bylines do state their intention to create such a league in the future. The Premier League lasts from September to April, with each team playing 18 games. Though teams are spread across the island, most Premier League sides can be found in the territory's capital, Hamilton, and its surrounding parishes. As an interesting side note, there are no Premier League teams located in the territory's largest city, St. George. However, the population of St. George is just under 2,000. Stadiums also vary greatly in the country between 400-seater stadiums like Warrior Park and St. John's Field to Bermuda National Stadium, where the Devonshire Cougars and the North Village Rams play. The most successful side in the Premier League has been the Pembroke Hamilton Club Zebras, who have won the league 11 times, including the 2018-2019 title. They are followed closely by the Somerset Trojans, who have won the league 10 times. Besides its leagues, there is also a Bermuda FA Cup, your standard knockout competition. The most successful side in this competition has also been the Pembroke Hamilton Club Zebras, who have won the title 11 times. Football was first brought to Bermuda by the British settlers in the early 1900s, and the Bermuda Football Association was later formed in 1928. It wasn't until 1963 when the Premier League was formed, and it has been going strong without interruption ever since. Though Bermuda is not a U.S. overseas territory, a club from Bermuda, the Bermuda Hogs, was created in 2006 to compete in the USL Second Division, which is the third tier of soccer in the United States. The team was around for a few years and never did very well until it was dissolved in 2013. According to the official bylines of football in Bermuda, there are no limits to foreign players and each team gets prize money, at varying amounts of course, depending on how well they do during the Premier League season. In this latest edition of both the Premier League and the First Division, my research says that there was only one foreign player playing in either league. That player was from Ecuador. In previous years, foreign players have hailed from nearby Caribbean countries like Jamaica and Trinidad and Tobago. Though a fair amount of players from Bermuda's national team play within the country as well, national team talent can be found playing within leagues in places like England, Ireland, the United States, Sweden, Italy, and even Estonia. Fun fact, the top scorer of the Bermuda Premier League of all time was Coolridge Bell back in 1978-79, who scored 35 goals. Though it's not exactly clear, it does appear that certain Digicel Premier League games can be seen on TV locally in Bermuda. For those out of the country, videos of the league can be found on YouTube in pretty decent quality and are fairly up to date. If you know anywhere to find highlights or live streams of either league in Bermuda, you know what to do. Leave a comment or a link below. Well, that's it for Bermuda. Thanks for watching. Coming up next is one of the world's most isolated countries. It is Bhutan.